All right. So, I just got done off-screen grinding all the way up to this point. Um, I don't think I've actually recorded anything since def uh, finishing Nightmare Difficulty, but eh, I don't think anyone really cares. Um, so, it's time to start Ubers, and uh, I'm actually going to start with Death Projector today. I know normally I start with, uh, with Butcher, but uh, eh, we'll do something different for a change of pace. Start with the Death Projector since I've already made my way here. Now, I already have Butcher's Tooth and the Optical Detector, which is the Infernal Machine one. Eh, those are no big deal. Those went, honestly, about as well as expected. And I've leveled up since then, so they're gonna go even easier. So let's see, can I do this first try, or am I gonna suck majorly and die? I'm also not sure if these guys still have Gift of Inner Fire. They could very well. Uh, yeah, Hoplites, just go ahead and die. Just die, please. There we go. So, this... I think this will be pretty easy. Just gotta, I'm just gotta kite these guys around. And as you can tell, my damage is not exactly as high as I would like it to be. I mean, it's, oh, I guess it's okay, but I, I need to be doing more than this, for sure. And dead. Alright, so I think the only thing about the laser focus crystal that can change is the experience that it gives. So, we'll just put that I guess here. And as always, my as always, my inventory looks like shit. So let's see, what did I get? I think I got a bunch of garbage. Sacred would be good if I... If I was going down the cold path and use frozen breath, which... Eh, I could do. And now I have enough strength. Especially after, uh... I, I'm gonna have enough strength once I get my 110 charms to wear everything I want, so now I can pump into energy. And now I think it's time to start Butcher. Oh, oh, and we're just right here. Come on, El Capris. Just die, please. Thank you. I also have, I'm at the love, I'm also at a point where I can now pick up jewels and actually use them because now, now the area level is 100 plus. So I can get the maximum amount of uh, stuff that I want. Maximum amount of modifiers. There we go. Um, real quick, this is still the same. Uh, this is still 
the same. And then I replaced... I replaced, um... T4, Rapid's Foot, with this. Um, got the maximum fire resist, I... Or enemy fire resist I could possibly get out of this. And a base of 21 fire spell damage after the blessing, which is pretty good. Um, on the script... On the skill screen, it might look like I do less damage, but I actually do slightly more because of the added pierce. So we're just going to go straight to Butcher. Alright, I'm just going to hide out in the corner. Uh, all of you guys focus on the Butcher, please. So this goes... Uh, can you just... Yo, minions, can you attack the Butcher? Don't fucking attack that other garbage. Just attack the butcher. Yeah, you keep the butcher occupied while I'm just gonna sit here, camp out for a while, and let dragon worms do all the work. And one more. Okay, there we go dead. Easy peasy. I do not need to pick that up because I already have one and Butcher's Tooth does not have any varying stats whatsoever. Oops, I interrupted your welcome back speech, Kara. Oh well. Wait. Oh, that's dark wood. Oh. Rubbing my eye there. Where's the... Where's the dude? Get the hell out of here, Invader Shaman. I've learned, I've learned well by now to not progress until I kill everything within a 20 mile radius, otherwise I get pincer attacked and completely fucked. Out of here, Dark Huntress. Oh, nice, two jewels. Oh, okay, that's not nice. Uh, oh, I need to buy oils of... Oils of craft. I will not interrupt you, uh... Geed. You. you again. Since the rogues have been moving back into their monastery, they haven't been buying anything from me. Tell I've heard that a few times. Oh, just buy a bunch of oils of craft. 
I do need to get around to actually, well, drink that and getting around to jewel crafting. Not a good modifier. Not good. Not good. Uh, okay, we're at a point where this could be pitched. Goodbye. Oh, I don't have any, uh, I don't have any arcane shards. Nope. Okay. Also, I did find a, um, I guess I found two sacred Huns Googles. And yeah, I, I have two. I have two of each base item, so I can always, I can wear one and improve the other. You should always do that if you plan to get a craft. At least that's you know what, screw it. I'll just I'm just gonna accept two percent spell damage for right now, but later on as 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 I level up and get more charms, etc., I am gonna focus more on getting uh not only two percent fire spell damage at least, but also with better modify other modifiers. I guess I'll accept two percent fire spell. 2% spell damage or more, well, 2% fire spell damage or more for right now with nothing else. But again, I'm gonna improve that as I as I get more charms and level up, because I need to in order to survive. Get the hell out of here. Of course, I find abandoned shrines quickly on this build. If I was, if I, tr if I revisited the Throsen, I wouldn't be able to find abandoned crafts. No siree. I fully expect to just get gibbed here. Surprisingly, no. I'm still picking up. Bloodstone. I'm still picking up resistance gems anyway for, uh... I know I'm not going to be there for a while, but for QT. Yep, this is exactly why I keep uh, hoplites around. 108, I have earned a new max skill level. So, dragon heart, dragon worms, and incarnation. No, wrong. Wrong holy set item. I don't think it... Eh. This is a lot more common these days. Where's my... There it is. At least now I can finally start pumping into energy. Ow. Okay, get out of here, buddy. Oh, no. Eh. May as well just drink my potion. Even though there's no reason to have that potion. Okay, I'm just gonna throw up a portal. 
Oh boy, please don't fuck me, Alpha Centaur. I assume there's gonna be an Alpha Centaur here. Or maybe I or maybe that won't matter if uh Oh, there's there's Alpha Centaur. All right. I was gonna say it might not matter if I can just give the thing anyway. Uh, move out. Oh. At least the Infernal Machine doesn't have Teleport as a modifier. I'm not sure if this is still a thing in Sigma, but I know in Old Median, if the thing had Teleport, it would move around the map. Okay, I'm not going to be able to push. Come on! Fucking mana! I have one mana! Well, I'm fucking dead, because my mana pool is fucking pitiful. Please just kill this shit. Thank you. Go. Actually, I'm not sure if it was mana or if my thing ran out. My, uh, solar flare. mana potion. Gotta chug that shit like a scoop, like a fucking dr wino druggy. Oh, it's dead. Let's see. Hey, perfect roll too, so I don't have to farm this again. And then, you know, I think I'm gonna save the. Uh, the storm oasis for last. Most of the segment will end up being Island of the Sunless Sea, I'm guessing, because I can kill the normal guys in there, but uh, when I last tried getting in there off screen, can we please kill stuff? Um, the Sunless Angels were not exactly taking my drag. We're they were not exactly taking a lot of damage from dragon worms. So I said, screw it, this is gonna take too long. Uh, just teleport. Come on, give me some rare quilted sacred armor. Er, uh, rare sacred quilted armors. Pick up the gold, please. Thank you. Uh... Thank you. 
think I need to stop with the frozen breath since I don't have the mana for it. Well, hell, once I respec, I'm probably only going to put the point in there as a prerequisite and not even use it otherwise. And down goes Geed and his mentor. Alright, Sunless Sea. Let's see how obnoxious this shit is. I'm guessing the answer will be extremely fucking obnoxious. But, I'll wait. Okay, I can kill these dudes quick enough, which I knew I'd be able to do that. Come on now. Thank you, thank you. Yo, stop following me. Follow them. Yeah, you can see how ridiculously low my damage is right now. Yeah, you can see how ridiculously pathetic my damage is against this. Although, they do have Spectral Hit and Magic Resistant, which may raises their fire resistance quite a lot. Spectral Hit raises their resistances, at least in base, at least in the vanilla D2, by, I think it was 25%. And Magic Resistant raises it by another, I want to say, another 25. And they start with 35. So, they would... If my math's correct, and assuming that this is correct as of median, that thing has a base of 85 met fire resistance. I could be wrong, but yeah. Well, at least now I can hit them hard. Well, kinda hard. By kinda hard, I mean... At least I can keep them at bay for a little bit. Until my mana runs out. Uh. No. Don't you dare. I'm not sure why rare amulets and rings aren't showing up on my drop notifier. Oh. I keep forgetting to do that. Keep forgetting to do that when I start a game. So that's that. So I have to do this in the next 15 minutes or so because of the server reset. Come on. 
Come on. Ah! That was my fault there. I wasn't paying very close attention to what I was doing. Again, for rings, I'm looking for plus skills, fire spell damage, and fire pierce, mostly. Uh, yeah. There we go, bucko. I do, th I think the summons, or the minions here should have the terrifies minions tag to let people know that minions are going to run away when they get hit. I mean, I realize that's always been the case. But in case some new player comes in here. Although it's pretty minor. Come on, Fair. Please die. Okay, this one has mana burn and not magic resistance, so you can see how much fucking server lag. Shut the fuck up, incineration beware. Nobody cares about your fucking geek speak. That story does not. I don't need. I do not wish to go into that story, is why I made that comment. But yeah. Since this thing does not have magic resistance, you can see how much more damage I'm doing. Finish it off. There we go. So yeah, magic resistance definitely added fire resistance to the past angel. diamond. I wanted to make sure that wasn't a ring, even though I think rare rings still show up with the drop filter turned on. Actually, let me test that real quick. Amulets do. What about rings? Or did I throw all mine away? Okay, cool. They do. That right there is just proof that I should have been that I should have been playing with that more often.
Ooh. That's pretty good. Oh, I'm giving up a lot of resistances, though. Some of which I do... Actually, hold on. Do I need all of these? I do need a little poison resistance. You know what? I think I'm gonna hold on to this. Oh, yeah. I'm gaining lots of spell damage. Like, my... My spell damage just straight up increased there because of the plus skills. But more importantly, I have a bit more fire pierce. What do you have? Spectral hit and magic resistant. Yeah. So you're you're gonna tank this shit. Come on now. I don't think having five makes a whole big big difference compared to having just one. Fair. There we go. Fucking assholes. Quit path blocking me. I don't appreciate being path blocked. You cheap bastards. God, I gotta get more summons up too. Perfect. Bam. More energy. Yeah, I guess I'll... I still am not sure if I want to S-max that or just leave it at a point. I'm thinking max, though. 
Uh, I'm real surprised I didn't die there. Get, get rid of this. Okay, well, you're, you don't have, uh... There we go. Oh! Out. Cut, make a shortcut. I'm running low on time. Bum bum. Thirteen versus two ninety two. I almost feel like getting ammo. I almost feel like ammoing my ship with plus energy, just to get slightly more mana. But I know that's gonna be a waste if I do. pick up that onyx wherever it is I don't know how I didn't see that or rather how I didn't notice it oh another cursed hit another magic resistant one Getting close. If my spell damage and mana was acceptable, then I would have already cleaned this shit out. Oh, I need to get another dragon warm up. There we go. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, one more. I would. I would like to show the the new 105 Uber in this segment. Four. Okay, well, this guy doesn't have magic resistant.
Uh, throw up a dude. Throw up another dude. Come on, please give me the... Where did you go? You cowardly little fucking shit! There we go. And, okay, innate elemental damage, plus whatever this gives, please be good. Ah, uh, that's shit. Let's see. Does that improve? It does not improve spell damage. Okay, so the only thing I would farm that for is as um, um, pierce. Alright, so the next... So I know this next Uber has Lockout. Uh, I think it's 20 seconds? I know I need... I know I need a fair bit of Lightning Resist, which luckily I am maxed. I haven't uh, stacked it, but... We'll see. Storm Oasis. Invasion. Whoa! Wait, does this guy move? No, he doesn't. I'm not sure how you're meant to avoid the sw the spiral attack, but uh, I imagine that if you go into this, yeah, I don't think I don't know if you can avoid the swirling attacks, but with potions and max lightning resist, this does not seem difficult. Yeah, first try, easy peasy. Ooh, that is nice. I like that quite a lot. Class charm. Oh wait, that's just literally the the uh, the old veteran one. Also, is this? I think this is. Oh, okay. I thought for a moment that this was custom music. Also, the lightning traps still go off. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna die to this. I'm gonna die to this and see what it says I got killed by. Go on. Thunderstorm. Okay. I wondered if it might say I died to a mysterious force or something. Alright, so that's all the 105 Ubers. I will see you guys next time for the 110s. Farewell.